just had a birthday and a week off, but before we have a look at what I did for my birthday this year, let's take a quick look at what I did last year. Last year we were only allowed five kilometres from the house, so we spent much of the day inside. I had wanted to go to the Aran Islands, so this is me trying to take a picture of me looking as if I'm on the boat to the Aran Islands. I don't, I don't know what I was thinking. They're awful. Don't look good. I was also quite desperate to get out and about and so thought that hammock canoeing could maybe be the next big thing. Getting lots of good pictures. Here I am kidding on that I'm not the murderer in a Poirot. Or at least trying to kid on that I'm from a Poirot. Look at that face! Andrew had infused some vodka with uh, gorse flowers. So here we are enjoying a couple of them. And of course we topped the night off with a nice fire. Now let's talk about this year. We're allowed inter-county travel! So we did the Sleeve Bloom Way, which is a looped walk around the Sleeve Bloom Mountains. The Midlands are really flat. Really, really flat. Oh God! The flatness! We're gonna fall off! It's like we've never taken a picture before. I, I don't know. Camouflaged in amongst all of the roots and branches and such. A really impressively large herd of goats. Look at them go. Yeah. We talked about Hugh O'Neill and his basically basically broke out of the siege and marched his entire army, like pretty much the length of the country from the Bera Peninsula up to Ulster. Marched to the area in 1601. <laughs> Here we see a very rare sighting and finding in the wild. You know, we don't want to startle it, so we're very quiet. There we have it. A battery in the wild. Isn't that magnificent? The red and black signifying danger, warning predators to stay away. And so we will. Found this strange abandoned house where I had a right good nosy. I don't know how, but we've acquired another collie. Her wee dog stayed with us while we ate our tea, and then some walkers came the other way and he walked back home with them. Isn't they cute? Um, I'm sorry. I don't, don't know. Washing the dishes. Having a coffee. And there's Tenty. And we are heading that way. When we first left it looked like the weather could go either way. There was a touch of blue sky and some clouds. But the longer the day went on, the more cloud came in, the more rain, and it rained, and it rained.
it looks as though there's a boardwalk all the way to the cairn at the top. Uh, I can't see much else. My Landry stops to take some paracetamol. Let's have a look at the view. You can see a tiny bit there. Nothing, nothing. That's quite cool. Nothing. Oh, oh, is that a bit of view? Maybe? On our way back down and towards the camp, it did start to ease off a bit. It wasn't as rainy. We even got a little bit of blue sky. And luckily it was off when we got to camp for the evening, so we managed to dry everything off and get a dry tent up and even have a little fire. on it and some hand ropes. I think it Hello grannies. So that's us finished the sleeve loom way. It was a really nice walk although we got rained on as you would have seen got home to some birthday presents so i've not opened them yet and also got some uh, snazzy trousers that i bought and some snazzy shoes so we're just having a wee drink and then and getting the washing all done before we get everything packed up and go away tomorrow. That leaves one for decorating it. The resistance bands. Oops. <laughs> oh, and shake those hips. Oh, aye, that's, 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 that's a problem, yeah. That's what it is. <laughs> I don't know why I can't do it. It's nearly it. Start it at your neck and you might just have it. <laughs> <laughs> Mountains cake might be rotten. The fifth of May. I only bought it yesterday. Thank you. 
Oh, you're there. <laughs> Look at how high they bounce! <laughs> You'll have had your holiday then. 